Hey guys, what's going on? It's Vic here, back with another episode of Wheel of Franchise, and I know you guys are excited to see this because I really did screw up on the last episode against the Vikings, but we did lose to the Vikings, I believe it was 24 to 15, but we are here with the Falcons, and I actually have the clips right. Congrats to me. I know, I'm pretty cool, guys, but we are training some players here, and uh, we are in week 15, here to face the Falcons, who we haven't played all year, first time playing them, we're going to be playing them in week 17 as well, and Darius Slayton, I'm going to go into physical now, just because he already has a superstar dev, and release, that's good, I want his release to go up more, and everything else here looks pretty good to me. So, other than that, boys, we're going to get into the team and look into the Falcons, who are 8-5. and five. So, the winner of this match takes the division. So, that's actually a pretty big deal because I would like to get a first-round buy in the playoffs. That'd be pretty cool. I'm not going to have a playoffs mm -hmm. wheel, but I will have a Super Bowl wheel, I believe. But other than that, boys, uh, this is what the team looks like currently. And it looks pretty solid. So, enough of me rambling. It is time to get into the wheel spins. And for our first wheel spin of the day out of the three wheel spins, the first one will be any player dev up? No way, but we got to go on the positions we await, do we? Wait, no, this is just any player dev up. I can give any player a dev up. Let's go. Darius Slayton X Factor? Maybe? Or Justin Herbert X Factor? That's a good question. Plus two wide receiver agility. So Darius Slayton getting treated much love today, but still... Our third and final wheel spin is going to be plus four stat up any a uh, plus four stat up for any stats, but on the position wheel. So we're gonna got, have to go over here. No cuts, no edits. Position wheel. What are we gonna get here? We are going to get middle linebacker. Any, any, any. Nope. Middle linebacker. Middle linebacker. Quan Alexander. So here we are with Darius Lane. I'm gonna up his agility. But I'm not going to give him the X Factor. You guys may be wondering why. But Terry Slayton is progressing tremendously fast. He is His overall is going up super, super fast. And that's really good. But Justin Herbert is really, really struggling. And if I get him that X Factor, I feel like I can play a lot better with Justin Herbert. And so you guys are probably wondering why I won't give it to Terry Slayton. That's the reason why. Also... At the end of the year, I'm going to be doing an MVP dev up. So you guys are going to vote who is the MVP of the series. And I think most likely, not, not officially, but most likely everyone's going to vote Darius Slayton. But that's going to be a poll for my post. So keep an eye on that at the end of the year. But Der Justin Herbert has pro reads, quick draw and closer as his abilities. I really wish he got something else other than pro reads. Anything other than Truss and Pro Reads would be good, but still not the worst I've ever seen. Quan Alexander over here with Star Dev, and we're going to give him that plus four speed, actually. Uh, I could go hit power, but I would like to go speed instead. He's already really fast, so going from 87 to 91 speed is a big upgrade for uh, Quan Alexander. So enough of me stuttering and stumbling all over this. You guys are here for the game. And I probably threw that up at the screen at the beginning of the video if I didn't forget. But for right now, we're going to look into the other team. And we're going to be looking into the Falcons, obviously. Let me scroll down and find them. QB is going to be Gardner Minshew. Minshew Magic out here. Halfback, Tevin Coleman stays with the Falcons, which is interesting. Fullback, doesn't matter. Chris Godwin, Brandon Cooks, and Kendrick Bourne. So pretty speedy receivers overall. They got Jack Doyle. O-line is looking pretty average. Nothing insane. Left end, Joey Bosa, Justin Houston, and Fletcher Cox. Elite pass rush there. Dre Greenlaw, Avery Williamson, uh, Tyler Frackle, or oh, Fackle, I feel like an idiot. Desmond Trufant, Trayvon Mullen, Quandre Diggs, Ronnie Harrison as well. Ronnie Harrison is a very solid, free, strong safety. So this actually seems like a pretty solid team. I wouldn't be too surprised if we lost, but they're 8-5, and five, and this game is for the division, so this really, really matters a lot, and we're going to be disregarding the X-Factors, because if we win, we get more XP, and it's just a lot easier to do that. But anyways, guys, apart from that, it is time to jump into the challenge wheel. So now here we are with our challenge wheel before we get into the matchup. And our challenge for the day is two forced fumbles. That's actually going to be a lot harder because I turned the slider up on that. And if you turn the slider up on fumbles, they actually go down. But we're going to start out here with the fourth and one on our highlight. Very risky in our own territory. But we're going to get the first down here. And I'm going to go fullback run again because that got us like five yards. More than Dion Lewis will ever get us. And I'm giving it to my tight end. And he's going to have some space. The tight end goes. What a block. I'm pretty sure that was a block in the back. But still, go. Why does my tight end 
have so much more speed and so much better than Dion Lewis from two rushes. That makes no sense. Still, very great start. And speaking of Dion Lewis, we're going to pound it with him. And Dion Lewis gets his touchdown. Touchdown Bucks. And for us, now it's the Falcons' ball. So the Falcons have the ball with Minshew Mania, Minshew Magic, however you want to call it. And they're going to run drag routes and cheese plays. And that's going to be a slant route to Chris Godwin. And I can't really blame him for running that. I run slant routes with Slayton all the time. And now... We're going to be playing more zone coverage because of Chris Godwin. But, oh, I bet on that run really, really hard, and Chris Godwin is wide open. No, that's not Chris Godwin. That was a huge hit, but I don't even know who that was. I don't know who that receiver was, but either way, it doesn't really matter to me. And they're going to run it. No, they're going to play action. I bet on it again, and Chris Godwin is going to get down to the two. Great play by the Falcons. They seem to love running play action, but I'm pretty sure this is a run. Yeah, they're motioning a player, and it's not a run, and they're going to... They're going to score a touchdown. I keep biting on all these runs when it's not. Touchdown, Falcons. But here we are back on offense, and we're going to be looking for Deontay Harris on the slant. And there he is. Go down with it. Thank you, Deontay Harris. First down for the Buccaneers. And once again, I'm going to be looking for Darius Slayton on the slants. Slayton slants. That's our new series name. Slayton on the slants, baby. First down. Now we are looking for something else here. Maybe that tight end is open. No, I, I held the ball too long. That is a god-awful throw. Throw on the run, inaccurate bullet pass. God, that pisses me off. You have an X factor, dude. Whatever, 75 overall still. Um, we're going to be sending some heat here. Will that get there? Matt Ryan's looking. And we're great swat down by Marshawn Lattimore. Way to make a play, dude. And now we're looking for something else. And huge hit by Quan Alexander, I think. What a beast. And th this is definitely going to be a run. This has to be a run. Blitz this. Blitz this. Come on. Get in there. Shed that block. Stuff him in the backfield. Tevin Coleman isn't going anywhere. Great shed by me. First down. Well, not first down. Fourth down for them. But it's a first down for us as we get the ball back from the punt. Slayton on the slants, baby. It's too easy. We get a juke, but it doesn't really get much after that. But still, Darius Slayton continues to be awesome. Now we're still on offense. Darius Slayton might be there. I'm, I'm not even going to risk it. I'm going to take off with Herbert as he has low stamina, but that's still a first down converting on third and 10 in the third quarter. Now it's fourth down, but I'm just going to take my field goal here and take the lead as well. Justin Tucker pins it and drills it. It's 10-7. Now we're playing more zone like we always do. I usually like to play man and Madden 21 because it's really easy. And that's another big hit. Marshawn Lattimore as I switch on. And once again, they have the ball. Let me cover that. Everything's covered. You got nowhere to go. Jeffrey Simmons Jr. brings him down. Minshew magic is no more. And we can't cover everything. Please, ah, oh, I tried to switch on to the strong safety and get a user hit stick. But still, first down for the Falcons. And they're looking for something, and they can't get it. Jalen Smith with the sack. Minshew magic no more. More zone coverage because we can't seem to contain uh, Chris Godwin on man coverage. And once again, he's backing up too far, and he goes down to a second string D tackle. I don't even know who you are. And still, it is fourth and one in the fourth quarter. I'm going to stretch it, and this could be Kyle Huszczyk. Kyle Huszczyk got some space. Kyle Huszczyk first down, risky play, but still, that's probably going to be the game. And now only one minute left in the game. Ground pound with Deion Lewis as he's going to fight for the first down. And that will most likely be the game. Way to fight for it. And yep, we take our knee. 10-7. to 7, Very low scoring game. Very short episode, I would say, especially in terms of gameplay. But I hope you guys still did enjoy because I know I did. I won't show the team next. I guess I'll just finish it off here. You guys don't really need a super long outro. But anyways, guys, I'm very sorry for what happened during the Vikings in episode 14 it was really disappointing but i really hope to keep this series around it's a big struggle it's really hard to make these videos i hope you guys can understand that but anyways guys apart from that i will see you guys all in the next one